let's talk about a common acids and its uses there are some set of uh, common acids which is really used for real time purposes you can see the first acid is hydrochloric acid so the chemical formula is hcl so it's used for stomach acid so hcl acid to clean the stomach you can see here and sulfuric acid which is taken for car batteries over here nitric acid for explosives over here your acetic acid is used for preparing your vinegar for food products and your carbonic acid is used for sodas and your phosphoric acid is used for flavorings so these are the chemical formulas available you should note it down now we'll talk about the chemical term of an acid acids are termed as a substance that form hydrogen ions when dissolved in water so we'll see a typical examples hydrochloric acid hcl will give h plus and cl minus ion it's it's hydrogen and chlorine ions sulfuric acid will provide h plus ions and sulfuric sulfate ions but as nitric acid will provide hydrogen and nitrate ions so this is how your acid if it reacts or dissolves in water it will provide or it will emit your hydrogen ions so these are the typical acids which i have told hydrochloric sulfuric and nitric acid and the acidity is really huge you should not touch it if we talk about the bases what are the base the base or oxides and hydroxides of metal that react and neutralize acids to form salts and water so you can see here i got my acid i got my acid and which react with the base to form the salt so bases which are soluble soluble in water that's called alkalis the alkalis are substance that form hydroxide ions you can see potassium hydroxide koh will have hydroxide ion so obviously it's considered as base the bases are segregated as the base is soluble and insoluble so soluble is called alkalis and the insoluble or insoluble bases as i told you got your acid with base it will react to give you salt and water now we'll talk about the base properties the base is a slippery in touch it tastes bitter changes the color of indicators reacts with acids to form salts it will turn lead litmus to blue and promote certain chemical reactions your red will convert into blue so this is called as base if we talk about the acidity of your base the acid of a base is said to be as the ionizable hydroxide ions present in an alkali so sodium hydroxide is monoacidic the reason is it's emitting one hydroxide ions whereas calcium hydroxide it emits two hydroxide ion then it's called diacidic so if it is monoacidic in that case one hydroxide and diacidic if it is having two hydroxide if we talk about the properties of the base we have seen it before it's bitter in taste it turns the litmus paper to blue react with acids to produce a salt and water it's electrolyte aqueous solution which will take care of conducting electric current it feels slippery to the skin and the basic substance are referred to being it's alkaline if 
we talk about the properties of bases the base react with the fats to form soap and glycerol this process is called a saponification base will have a ph value which is greater than 7 dilute solution of bases it stays bitter the bases neutralizes acids and it reacts with acids to form salt and water 